Hello everyone, this is Wilson's Imperial Bricks, and welcome to my review of another Minifig Co. order. This order contains two officers, which are Grand Admiral Thrawn and Colonel Ularin. So, let's get right into it. You got the premium packaging with a lot of with detail over every side, and here are the mini figures. They also have an Admiral Praj head, and here they somehow put it in this giant bag. But here's a good look at that. There's a new new sticker I haven't seen before. I like a retro sticker. I believe this is an Imperial officer gun, which is really cool. Obviously I can't use it in a mock because it's in this bright color, but it's still nice to have. This is a freebie. Now the mini figures. First we'll go, we'll save Grand Admiral Thrawn for last because he's probably the best one. First, Colonel Ularin. Colonel Ularin has, we'll compare him to the regular Colonel Ularin from the Lego promo. So as you can see, Colonel Ularin on this one has a lot, a lot, um, a lot more detail and depth to it and um, smaller badges. Regular Colonel Ularn has larger badges. There is arm printing, like they represent sleeves on the, uh, on the Minifig Co. one. Also, they print under the arms on the Minifig Co. As one as well. On the back, just a little bit more depth on the other one. And that printing continues on to the back side of the hips. So speaking of the legs, these the legs are not even a comparison <laughs> because Minifig Co's legs are a thousand times better. You can see even on the back of the legs they have dual molded legs with printing on the back. There's also printing on the side. And I'm not sure if there's printing in between the legs. It doesn't look like it. But, um, so you, know, you have the boots for the officer outfit. Regular Ularin doesn't. I do prefer the Ularin face on the, um, on the Lego one. That's, that's the, um, they both have the same hair piece. He kind of looks a little scared. So that is Colonel Ularin. Next, Grand Admiral Thrawn. Oh yeah, and the, the best thing, one of the best things about Colonel Ularin is he comes with these pants. So you can um, switch it out so he looks like Director Krennic when Director Krennic had these all black pants as well. And side of leg printing back of leg printing um really good as well on you lauren though i prefer these legs i'm gonna put these legs on a different white suit imperial officer so they'll all be used probably uh, next figure is grand admiral thrawn this figure just like you lauren with the other legs this one comes with another head. Uh, instead of, they probably could have just made a double-sided face, to be honest. But they just went the extra mile and got an angrier head for, um. Now, let's cut the chase and get the comparison. I'd say... It looks like it's the skin tone's the same, 
might be a little lighter, but but yeah, you can determine a little bit more about Grand Admiral Thrawn's face shape through the minifig co one. Now here's the, um, so the hair is a different color, although it's, is it a real Lego piece? Yeah, but they just recolored it. So in Minifig Co's description, they say this hair is more accurate, which, um, I agree with. So now the glaring issue here besides the printing, is that Grand Admiral Thrawn here has no, um, no yellow badges, um, from the Rebel, sh Rebel show. As you can see there, Grand Admiral Thrawn here has the yellow badges. So, um, what I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna put the Admiral Paraj head on this one so he can, um, so it can be like a different rank, a different, like, like Vice Grand Admiral or something. Maybe I'll just keep this one in my collection as is, as like the Lego one and the Minifig Co. one. For my mocks, I think I'll be using the Minifig Co. one. Um, obviously, but there's a lot of classic, like, I've had this one for a while, like, when I was a kid. So this Grand Admiral Thrawn is, is pretty cool as well, but not as good as this. Just the same, the same legs as the other one, um, same comparison as white legs, like the Colonel Yularen, and then this one leagues better. Um... Same color blue hands. Back printing, just a little bit more depth. Same sleeves as Adam, as the Colonel Yularen, I believe. And let's talk about the gun. So here's the Lego gun that Grand Admiral Thrawn comes with. It's just the standard, standard issue gun, small gun. And I believe this is a brick arms gun, which is accurate. Um, which they say is accurate to the one he carries inside the film. Well, the show. Inside the show. So he had a good look at that. Here's also a good look at the figure. So yeah, there's, there's the comparison and the review of the figures. So thank you for watching this video and goodbye. Have a nice day.